out. So I thought I would record like randomly a little clip it of looking for some cat stuff because basically I know I said I was looking into getting a dog and I would still would like a dog um, but we ended up in a position where we're getting another cat which I'm so excited we haven't had I haven't had my own cat since my Onyx passed away like a couple of years ago and then we were still looking after Vera which was my brother's cat but she's since gone back to live with them since they um, settled into their new place um, so it's just been really empty and I don't know it's just not been a nice feeling not having in any little creatures around you know it's just something that I'm so used to so yeah my friend Chloe her boyfriend's actually um, got this kitten I think she's about a year now because um, at first we were gonna buy cats from them but they ended up going all together to a home which is fine don't it's nice when they don't have to get split up um, but this one they decided you know before they get attached they got quite a few pets um, they want to give it to someone that will be a good owner and Chloe's known me for years at this point she's known she knows I've always had cats so um yeah so I think we're gonna wait a couple of weeks because there's a few personal stuff happening at the moment that we need to sort out before we can commit properly um so I think we're gonna go into pets at home today to get like litter trays uh, maybe a few toys and that but I don't know I just thought I would that you guys know have like a really chilled vlog and then maybe include a clip when we go to get her and like the first kind of week or so after she settles in if everything goes to plan um just to see her progress i know this is going to be going up late but i think it is wednesday 24th yeah of april as i'm filming this intro um so yeah <laughs> And look at this little little tray. Are we going to get one of these ones with the lids again on actual? Oh, what's this? Cat litter tray. Why is it so big? I don't know. Or is it? Does it go to the side? It goes to the side. Does it? Sideways, and that's the air vent. Oh, like. okay. Huh? What sort of one was you after? That one looks interesting. purchased some basic things we've got a pink litter tray one of the flat ones with the lid i got a cat mat for the food bowls and stuff to go on mum wanted pink because she's stereotypical <laughs> But we got the food bowls, so dry and wet food and water bowl, and of course a litter pickup. And we'll slowly get some more stuff as and when, or maybe just all at once when we get the cat. Today is the day I'm meeting Chloe. We're going for lunch, and afterwards we're gonna go get the little kitten because um, I think I already mentioned, but it's her boyfriend that has the cat, and she's gonna drop me there with my little cat box. Um, we're gonna collect her and then she's gonna drop me back home which is kind of her and yeah I will show you little video clips of her as she's settling in and that um, hopefully it goes smoothly she was really friendly um, I think I already mentioned again um, when we went to visit her so hopefully she gets into the cat box nice and calmly and hopefully quickly gets used to the surroundings here when we take her back so fingers crossed it all goes well it's okay We'll be back indoors in a moment. Well, we're new indoors, but still. Right, let's get you out here. Hello. Hello. Oh, hello. Having a little look around your surrounding. She's gone behind. I know, we're going to get a, a tree. I'm going to get a tree at the end of the month, I think. Let me see if she's all right. Girl, that cage is heavy. Yeah, it is a good one. Hello. Alright, I'm just gonna let her get her bearings. <laughs> Leopard. Elsa running around. She does. Hey. I need to sneeze. <laughs> oh, bless me. Hello. Oh, because she was stuck over in that corner. She was coming out every now and then, but it wasn't for that long, was it? She's looking outside. That's what Chloe was saying. She's like, whenever so Sophia, the mum goes out, she just stares. Hey. 
Will you follow me? Just show you what your toilet and food is. How's that? Oh gosh. Uh oh. What's she seen? Is she making the noise? I think she is. Like, <laughs> How's that? What are you doing under there? How did you even. How did you get there? She's eating her ding dings. I had to pick her up to get her out here. She was starting to hide underneath. Oh, that's a really interesting patch there. Um, she started to hide underneath the telly. But then I lured her out of a treat and I took her out here so she knows where the food and water is, where the toilet is. Yeah, I think she's gonna, she might explore the stairs in a minute. <laughs> it's like, I think she's nervous of the area being new. She's not nervous of us, she's well friendly. But I think it's just, Obviously, we're not the people that she's used to, and we're in a different environment. So she's like, "What's going on?" <laughs> she runs down the stairs. Hello, strokey, strokey, stroke, and back up the banister, and woo, through the door, and big boo, and run. Woo, good girl. Oh, you're so clever. You're so clever. <laughs> Hi. Are you doing some spinny spins? Oh, good girl. You good girl. Oh, here you are. Oh, bum. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Oh. Hello. Good girl. <laughs> She's so affectionate. Oh, sitting on the stair. Hey. Come into the living room with us. Come on. Oh. oh. Hey. Pretty. You're loving too. Ooh. So I've been at work all day, but she's been upstairs in my mum's room, lured her out, getting her some food. Bless her, I'll just shut the door so hopefully she talks to us a little bit more. But mum was getting a little bit worried. But yeah, I've noticed she hisses a bit as well, but I don't know, it's weird because she's like stroking around us and then all of a sudden she makes this weird sound. But yeah. Hopefully she'll chill downstairs with us for a bit now. <laughs> After I got her out, she's like, come and see me in the bath because I started to get lower. It's just my leg, guys, don't worry. And she was like, her little head was popping up like, where have you gone? <laughs> Hello, Elsa. Oh. Oh, okay, she gone. <laughs> Hello. Oh, good girl. Elsa was very good. My cousin, my uncle and my auntie came round and we got her out, well my uncle got her out from underneath the chair. She was really friendly, everybody gave her a bit of a treat so that she'd come up to them even though she did anyway. And she almost could have run out the door with them, she was really friendly. And they were like, what are you talking about? She's not nervous, but you know how I said she gets a bit hizzy. Hello. Oh, <laughs> careful. But she was really friendly with them. Good girl. And we're just about to order her hello, a cat tree. Good girl. Good girl.
Oh, good girl. Good girl. So small. Good. What's that? Whoops. No, that's the toy on the carpet. Is she farting? <laughs> Ew. Hello, having a little venture into this room of all my mess. Hello, <laughs> what have you found? Hi. I hope she doesn't find a way to get under my bed, that's for sure. <laughs> Hello. Hello. <laughs> Just found a gap in my bookshelf. <laughs> oh, yeah, you. Talking about you. Don't eat that. Oh, you're okay. You're literally in a trunk. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Hello. Mm. So I just got a knock on the door. I left Elsa in my room and she just came when I came back up she was just nicely waiting for me by the door. Good girl. Oh, I was expecting her to jump up somewhere. But the cat tree arrived, so I'll set it up in a bit. Hopefully she'll have a bit of a uh, space to run around, climb up and stuff a bit more. And hopefully be very, very happy. Yay! <laughs> so this is the tree. I'm not really sure where I'm gonna balance the camera. Um I need some scissors. Excuse the mess on the floor. What's this? So I got it from Amazon. It's called Cozy Pet Cat Tree in light grey. Oh hold on, there's a Oh sorry, didn't mean to scare you. This is so awkward to do one handed. Don't you eat that? Okay, 
Oh, she's gonna, she's gonna hit it. She's gonna hit it. This is my phone. Oh no. <laughs> oh, oh yeah. Yeah. Lots of parts to do. I'm not sure how I'm gonna go about assembling it. <laughs> oh god, I don't trust myself. It's gonna come in a more long box. I don't know why, but that's what I thought. So many parts. <laughs> so honestly, I thought it was going to come a bit more like. Hold on, let me turn it around. For some reason, I thought it was going to come like more put together. Um, but yeah, I'm going to try and fit build this up. Hopefully, if I remember, I'll show you a bit of progress as we go. Um, I'll probably just show you the end. <laughs> I know it's probably obvious, but it doesn't tell you when to use the shorter screws. It doesn't tell you how many screws you should have. That's the part that's a little bit confusing. Mm. Interesting. Sorry, I lied. It does tell you how many of each screw you get, and sometimes it tells you when to use them. So I've got to figure out if I've just used this correct one. Oh, frustration. I wish they were words. And in a little bit of a tizzy, I was like, I have no more of these screws. Then I realised I had them underneath here, and so I had to undo that so that these would fit in this sort of slot. So I was like, why isn't it working? Yeah. Uh, I get so confused <laughs> and we have done so this is ow this is how it looks um yeah it didn't really take too too long I'd say it took me about an hour or so um but I had to undo some things because I realized I used the wrong screws and I put things upside down but yeah this side looks quite sturdy she's already jumped up into that little cot thing but I was still like building it so I had to take her out um, but yeah, this is how it looks, so I'm quite happy with it actually. I'd say some of the holes are a little bit crude, like I had to like force things in a bit more. And like this, cloth didn't have a hole, although in the picture it depicted a hole. Um, so I had to sort of stab it through with a scissor, but um, yeah, quite happy. Oh my god, she's a beast. <laughs> Elza is getting adventurous. I think she wants to jump up in the bath, but she doesn't know it's a bath. And I'm like, no, listen to the water. You don't want to jump in here. You don't want to jump in here.
crazy girl. Crazy girl. I don't know if it's actually coming through. I've recorded it through my headset. My earphones, that is. <laughs> I just thought I'd come in and wrap up this video. Elsa is in a trance and yeah, I don't know if I mentioned already, she's stopped hissing like the first three days I think after that she's just stopped. She comes looking for me now like if I'm upstairs like sleeping I come out going to the toilet. She runs from wherever she is to say hello, she's really sweet. We've had lots of people um, come in to the house quite a lot of uh, this week. And um, she's been so good these, these past couple of weeks, I should say. And she's so calm with them. Like, she goes up to them, she says hello. She's like, she's been really good. She's such a people cat. Um, really, really sweet. So, yeah, she's settled in so, so well. Um, I'll update you guys, I'm sure, on social media and stuff. Um, yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this little... That was a vlog, um, so sweet, um, and I will speak to you in another video soon, bye.